Alright, hey guys, with Abomination9 here, and we're back playing some more Pokemon stuff. Now, this, like I said in the last video, is called Pokemon Gotta Make Em All Project Studio Blue Version. Uh, this is a Nintendo sealed game, uh, seal the quality game. Their seal is on the box of the software. Uh, and yeah, so we're just going over like archaic Pokemon software on the computer because, like I said, when I originally wanted to do the Pokemon trading card video it was because a bunch of controversy or something was going on over the trading card game, like the digital version. I don't I don't remember. I feel like it was. Maybe I'm wrong, but I'm pretty sure there was some kind of controversy going on. And I wanted to do that, but I finally got to run to it now, which is like years after like it even, it even means anything. But I just wanted to show off even more software that I had for years that has to do with Pokemon. So this is pretty much like an actual editing software or something that lets you make Pokemon stuff. There's a lot of these things back in the olden days of early like computer stuff where there were just programs dedicated for making like postcards or like origami or just decorations and stuff like that. So we got, and it's not gonna look like this. This is just the start it'll actually go up into like an actual window this is just what it looks like when you start off uh, so we have greeting cards signs birthday kits banners photo fun stationery character cards em uh, envelopes calendars postcards crafts certificates stickers and uh, that's just a blank page I guess you can just start with a blank page if you wanted to but we're gonna like cycle through some of this stuff customize a ready-made project or start from scratch hmm Let's click on that, see if it actually gives us. So yeah, we have all birthday, friendship, invitation. Do we have... Let's click on all and see if that... Okay, so we have an Abra invite. Even though we can't really see that. We got Ash and Pikachu, uh, Butterfree, Chansey, Charmander. Actually, uh, for some reason this guy and the eggs have... I have a problem saying. Executor is his name. Flareon, Gengar, Geodude... Uh, the starters. For some reason, Bulbasaur is bigger than the other two. There's a lot of postcards. Hitmonlee, Marowak. Now this only has 81 of the 151 Pokemon available in here because there is a red version and that has the other side. So if you wanted both, you would have to buy the red, which I only have the blue. I mean, I may have all this a... Oh my god. I might have all this... Why, why can I say it? I've said it like 20 times in the last video with this video combined. Archaic! I have all this archaic Pokemon software, yet uh, I didn't buy the red one back probably like 16 years ago, or however long it's been. Uh, Misty, Pikachu, uh, another Pikachu, like 20 Pikachus, Squirtle, Ash and Pikachu, Ponyta, Psyduck, Psyduck Team Rocket, uh, for some reason Eevee and Pikachu, Oh, let's see, we've got Signs, Customize, All, Charizard, Charmander, Voltorb, and Elect Electrode. I forgot his name, is that what, is, that's, is that what it is? Like, Voltorb and Electrode? Uh, Zubat, Golbat, Eevee, Executor, Flareon, Marowak, Misty, Misty, more Misties, a lot of Misties, Pikachu, Pokedex, bunch of Pokemon, Again, more Pokemon, the starters, Bulbasaur, Ash and Mish, uh, Misty, Pikachu, Psyduck, there's a lot of Psyducks. This is gift wrap, apparently, so this is for wrapping a present. So you're supposed to, like, obviously print. Like, I feel like I did a lot of printing and st stuff like that when I was younger on computers. Because that was just, like, the thing to do, to play in one of these softwares and just print all this stuff. Psyduck, Blastoise, Raichu. Size chart was this for music. Let's skip all this. Uh, let's go to so we can actually get in there. Photo. F let's go look at the character cards and then. Wait, what? Okay, customize and all of them. So there's Bulbasaur. Whoops. So this is just like info cards. You can like print your own kind of like specialized. I wouldn't say like Pokemon cards necessarily, but almost. This is just like Pokemon clip art, pretty much. Licensed by Nintendo. 
Okay, let's just like scroll through it. Like you can't really see this stuff. And I don't want to be here too long because obviously this window is really small. A uh, crafts. So yeah, there's like wearables, paper, decorative. Uh, so you can print out some badges. There. Uh, I think, yeah, some paper airplanes, fortune tellers. Those were the thing back in the day when you were... Uh, when you're a little whippers whippersnapper. I don't know if kids play around with these anymore. Do kids use these anymore? Fortune tellers? Like those, those were hip back in the day, but I don't know if they are anymore. Okay, so let's actually choose something. Let's just go with a blank page. Tall. Okay. So here is the actual software. Let's see if we can actually insert some stuff. Insert graphic. Bulbasaur. So we have different types of Bulbasaurs. Ivysaurs. Let's see, we got Charmanders, we got the, them. This has all the starters, which is like, what Pokemon are in the other red version? Since they have these versions, I would have to assume there's some mix between them, because you can't just not have uh, your starters and all their evolutions in the other version. Like, that would be the inferior version. Unless, like, that version has the legendaries. If you want the legendaries, you gotta get the red version. So Pikachu... The Nitos, Sand Slash, Jigglypuff, Meowth, Persian, Machamp, or the Muff family, whatever. Also, we do have Ghastly Haunter and Gengar. Now, I'm one of the people who are a fan of Haunter, like, more than the other ones. Like, I like Haunter more than Ghastly and Gengar. Like, if I, I don't really want to evolve into Gengar because I just prefer... Haunter, uh, as he is. So what else we got? Insert headline. Insert text block. Background effects. Also, it's really hard to install this because this is obviously meant for Windows 95 and 98. And uh, obviously my computer's Windows 8. And I don't have a 95, 98, or me, or 2000 computer lying around anymore. I mean, when I had... Obviously, when I originally got the software, I had those kinds of computers, but that was... Like I said, more than a decade ago. Let's see, what, what kind of backgrounds we got? Oh man, I remember all these things. Now, I'll insert a clip of me showing off a CD player that I strapped a Charizard to, or strapped a Charizard onto a CD player back uh, like a million years ago. And I'll also show you the, the jewel case that the, the software came in right now all right so this is what i was talking about so here's like a million year old cd player with a charizard attached to it that i printed out from that uh pokemon project blue a pokemon project studio blue back i don't know like 10 12 13 16 years ago i don't know when i was using it so often but that's how old this is the cd player and this picture are like a million years old and uh, here is the jewel case that it comes in obviously as you can see it still it still looks like really good like this hasn't really worn out from me having it probably because I haven't screwed around with the case too much if we don't open it up obviously I'm holding like the webcam too I'd, I forgot the CD inside the freaking uh, CD drive. I need to take that out. So yeah, let's go get the CD. And there you go. There is the CD. That is what it looks like. You can see the Nintendo seal of approval right there. Like I was saying, these are all licensed Nintendo products, just like the other one. All right, so yeah, that was that stuff. So we got some pretty good stuff. Like, it comes with, like, a lot of good art in it. You obviously have all these Pokemon, which they don't they don't really need too much detail to them, but look, we have our backgrounds. That, that's a really good background. Uh, and the other ones are pretty good too. That Pokedex looks like it was probably like ripped straight from the show. What else we got? We got the Sunset uh, Haunter. You're kind of like screwing it up, so let's just pop this Haunter up there. Just random haunter, like, in the middle of nowhere for no reason. Is there any spooky? There doesn't look like there was any spooky stuff. 
this I think maybe he could hang out in. If you could actually add in some like some shading to it, like I would have to open this up in like a different software and uh, throw some shading on him so he actually blends in with the rest of the stuff. So let's look at the more graphics. It actually sorts this stuff by type as well. Human. Pretty much has everyone. Look, we got Ash, we got Brock, we got James, we got Jesse, we got Misty, and Professor Oak. Like, who else do you really need? Well, Gary. I bet the red version has Gary in it. Put Ash over there. Haunter over here. Th this thing works very well. For being, like, what, 16 years old or so? Like, it feels pretty advanced, honestly. I was using this, like, all the time. Like, when I was home, I was playing this or other stuff like it. Just playing around with photos. I'm trying to look for a Pokeball. Was there a Pokeball in here? There's shapes. Oh, here we go. So you can do stuff like this where you can just like create a scene out of all these like little photos pretty much and it's just there. You don't have to like look for them. I'm pretty sure nobody knows about this software either. It's like the fact that I have it is just ridiculous. So I, I don't think I really need to go too much more into it. So I, we can't open up this again, which I probably should have just had from the get-go. Decorative. Oh yeah, I'm pretty sure you can buy accessories, or this came uh, packaged in a box where you can actually make these things, like a keychain. It came with like the little, I don't know, glass, plastic, that you can insert these uh, photos into, so you can actually make that stuff. I feel like there was other, like, things you could make too, other than just this. Like, I, I could have sworn there was like origami stuff too. What do we have in the sticker section? Uh, let's go with circles. With I'm pretty sure there are circles, yeah. Pikachu, Pokeballs. Obviously, you would buy sticker paper. See, I feel like uh, I, I've never heard anyone talk about this kind of stuff, but I used to just screw around with this kind of stuff all the time as a kid. Like, sticker paper, glossy paper, regular paper, card paper. And uh, what, what else kind of paper there was? There was, like, paper you could print, um... You can print onto a shirt or whatever, like, you would iron it on. I don't remember what it's called, but we'll just call it ironing paper. You can iron on an image onto a shirt, pretty much making your own custom shirt. Like, I've never really heard anyone talk about doing that kind of stuff. Like, I'm guessing it's just no one cares. Like, does anyone really care about printers anymore? Like, I guess 3D printers, but does anybody really use printers? Other than, like, people printing, like, I don't know professional photos, like a company that does that. I don't know. I just know, like, I used to do this stuff all the time. And we got certificates here. Calendars. Let's check out the calendars before we stop. Uh, monthly. The year 2000. Okay, so that tells us, that dates this. Uh, right there. This came out in the year 2000 since all these are dated for 2000. So yeah, 16 years just about. Oh man, Rapidash, Kadabra. I think that's Kadabra. I don't think that's Abracadabra. Because he only had one spoon. Magmar, Jolteon. Uh, it doesn't have a Flareon. I was hoping for a Flareon, but it has Jolteon at least. But it, it almost doesn't even matter because these aren't dated for this year. These are dated for 16 years ago. Oh, I guess they have different ones. Oh, there's a Haunter one. Oh, man. If only... Yearly, we have a... Why is there, like, a Shelter for the Yearly one? Do you think you would have something cooler than that? With Hydra. Or, not Hydra. Cedra, I think. I think it's Horsey and Cedra, right? Horsey's a smaller one. This is a Cedra. Bellsprout. Another Haunter. Did I look the tall? Yeah, that's what the one we were looking at originally. I don't think there's too much to really look at else. I mean, you can't really see this. Anyways, 
I think I am recording this at 1080, though, so you might be able to see this. So just, if you have a 1080 monitor, just uh, boost it up, because I'm recording this in 1080, and my monitor is 1080, so this is, in fact, captured completely 100% in 1080. Do you think I haven't looked at? Stationary? Like, if you want to write someone? Again, another arc archaic nonsense, actually writing people letters. So you can print out your own stationery to write to someone. Yeah, I think that's it. Let's just look through our graphics one last time. Emblems. We can actually just, oh, we can actually just slap this on there. Just the regular Pokemon, you gotta catch them all. I actually went out of the thing there. And... What else? Let's... Let's have more ghosts. Is it just them? Or do we have other ones? Yeah, it's just them. We just have, like, a bunch of them just floating around for no reason. I guess we can have a Gengar there, too. I mean, it doesn't, like, look like anything, but this is something you would probably throw together when you were... Living in that time. Also, Gengar should probably be bigger than that. I think Gengar is pretty big, like this. I think that's his actual size, Some, somewhere around there. But he's facing the wrong way. I don't know if I can flip him. Does not appear to be able to be flipped, unless I can do it over here. I mean, it doesn't really matter, right? Yeah, it doesn't matter, whatever. So yeah, guys, that was Pokemon Project Studio Blue for the PC. Uh, so yeah, thanks for watching. If you want me to screw around with this, though I don't know why you would, but if you would like to see me messing around with this thing again, you can just tell me what you want me to do. So yeah, guys, uh, thanks for watching. Tune into the next episode. Like, subscribe, comment. You know what to do. See ya.